okay so on this section we are going to customize our login process with my domain so let's do this with our trailhead playground or if you want to do it with your own production org you can but it's not recommended <laughs> just changing everything for your production org or you can do your sandbox first if you are in charge of administrating um, a real salesforce org already okay so we are going to go ahead and just do the challenge which is basically doing the whole steps that we are being um, explained on this trail so this challenge is uh, creating a my domain and just uh, enable my domain and uh, set up as a any custom domain and change the color to that so I'm going to go ahead to my trailhead playground so this is my trailhead playground so go to setup as usual gear icon setup and search for my domain over here my domain and now we can customize our um, login process our look and feel first let's change the url so on our playground here let me just crank this up a bit so you can see better this is our domain right because this is a playground emphatic bear dot random string dash def add so this is the url you can see on the top here right now we can change this let's change this for this playground and let's name this zone playground there you can check your availability by clicking that button now that's available so don't use a very good name on your playground though because once it's taken you can't use it on your real salesforce production org it's like buying a domain name once one is taken nobody else can take it right so login policy prevent login from there no we want to uh, for our users to still be able to log in from login.salesforce.com and from this new domain what about the redirect policy so let's do don't redirect meaning it's it's uh it's not redirecting anywhere so if we are changing to redirect the same to the same page within the domain it will redirect to the new url and if it's redirect with a warning to the same page within the domain it will redirect to the new url to the new one with a warning so i'm just going to choose do not redirect as it is the recommended one for now and as you launch um, a new domain on your salesforce org you might want to redirect because otherwise um, your users will be confused how come my login doesn't work because they have to log into this from this new domain right so you might want to redirect so for this example let's choose this i'm going to save this okay there are some um, alerts there okay now we're in so now we're in i am going to actually change the logos and stuff now we have changed the url login with your domain url to deploy your domain so we have to first login from here let's do that login to test it out let's log in from there you see the top now it's saying zone playground right zone playground dot or dash dev dash ed lightning force so that's working now let's go back to my domains and let's customize the rest I'm going to change the color and add a logo and add 
the right side of the login uh, uh, frame there. So let's edit this. Now the logo file, I am going to change this to my zone.io logo. Let's go here. I think we have a logo here. Um, zone logo one. Okay, it likes it. And I want to change the background color to that as it's instructed on the challenge. And I want to also set my right frame URL here to one of the zone page. Just to show you what can be done on the login page. Um, let's do this one, fundraiser. So I'm just going to copy this URL and close, close. So this is the right frame URL. You will see where this will load. Use native browser for user authentication on iOS. I'm going to leave that. Use the native browser for user authentication on Android. So I'm going to leave that. I'm going to hit save. Now we are logged out. Now let's log back in. So this is the URL. I'm going to copy that. If I log out, there we have it. So this is the right side frame URL. We have a black background and our logo on top which I changed to white so that's it okay so now we can check the challenge to earn our 500 points I'll see you on the next video where we are going to talk about set up single sign on for your internal users bada bing bada boom hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce app exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word Watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.